Often we see people as a service user or a client that needs support. Meet Bob. Things that have been said and recorded about Bob by the staff that support him are He's frail, has possible onset of dementia and is getting very confused. Struggles to mobilise, needs support with personal care as he's sometimes incontinent. Forgets to change his clothes, can be verbally challenging, hard of hearing. Although these terms describe some of the things Bob may find difficult, they don't really describe Bob the person. Bob can also be described as a husband, a father, a grandfather, an uncle. A highly skilled engineer who used to make engines for Concorde. A clever man who once appeared on Mastermind. A lifelong Notts County supporter. A scorer at his local cricket club. A gardener who had an allotment for 20 years and was well known for growing veg in the village. A great storyteller. A regular at the Fox and Crown pub. If we begin by looking at these strengths, interests, qualities and connections, we start to think about how we can use these to support Bob in a way that maintains his independence, builds on what he's able to do for himself and most importantly, provide support that makes sense and works for him. Take a minute to think about someone you support. Who do you see?